so Due to some violent content, parental discretion is advised. Bye. Hey everybody, it's Queen SG, and welcome back to the CE Podcast Show today. Hope y'all guys having a great day. Hope you're chilling, relaxing, and maxing, just all the way around. Today I want to talk to y'all guys about a few things y'all can do to keep yourselves from going crazy during this whole quarantine situation. Number one thing I would say is exercise. It's nothing to it but to do it. Exercise. Get fit. Use this time to just become a better version of yourself. Mentally and physically. You know, because it's easy to be like, okay, we're going to get up and exercise. But it takes that brain power, that willpower to get up and just do it. There's nothing to it but to do it. Just get up, exercise. You ain't got to go to the gym. But right now, we can't even go to the gyms because all the gyms is closed down right now. So I would just say, you know, go to the best next thing. Your front room. Your bedroom if it's big. You know, just just lay down or get up, put on some music, move and groove, you know? And if you can't do that, you feel like you ain't got the willpower to do that, you know, we even got solutions for that too. Like I said, y'all come to this show, y'all find different solutions to different problems. So you say that you can't exercise, you know, you need someone to help you out, that's okay. I'd like to introduce one of our sponsors, our newer sponsors, since we are talking about the idea of fitness or whatnot. Yeah, you can go on IG right now, Instagram, just plug in Fab Fitness for Sophisticated Vixens. You go there right now. They're going to hook you up. You, you, it, it, it's, it's a good, good place. I'm telling you, go there. They're going to take care of you. Great trainer. Hook you up. Reasonable plans. Exercises you can do just straight from your home. You need that one-on-one live video chat personal trainer. Oh, they got you. So definitely go there. Go to that Fab Fitness for Sophisticated Vixen at instagram they got the little booking right there boom book it it's gonna take you straight to the page get you all set up you need the consultation if you need help on meal plans they got you they got you okay so since we own that subject we we didn't discuss that then hooked you up and put you on phone big sis sg gotcha okay we're gonna go to a number two thing to do during this quarantine Get a new hobby. Or if it's an old hobby, an old passion that you used to do. Just just take that old hobby box, take it out, blow the dust off of it, you know, and get into it. Something I always wanted to do, I was like, you know, if I get enough time and I'm not working and I ain't busy, you know, I'm going to start painting. You know, I'm going to do little things like that, you know. Do that. Get your hobby. You never know. You can make your hobby and make that generate money. You know, I actually started painting. I was like, okay, I was feeling like Picasso. Like, I got some nice, nice little pieces, you know? And it's generating money off of it. You know, just because I took out time, you know, something was always on my head. I said, I want to, you know, do that. You know, if it's, if it's even if it's not that, if it's something else that you wanted to do, you know, rather you want to get better at playing a certain instrument or you want to do some type of you youtube or something or heck you even want to start like a podcast just whatever it is that you said that you want to do you know do that if you're unsure get a piece of paper just right now start five things that you would love to do or hobbies that you used to have just dig deep if you got to dig down back in your childhood before just working, which is the main thing we do. 
you know just go back just dig deep into that you know you'll be surprised what you'll come up with just whatever you like to do just just do it you ain't got nothing but time we're quarantining so i mean you're just gonna sit in the house let days go by not do nothing no that's whack just do that okay just just do a hobby okay another thing that she can do i can't remember if i was doing letters or i was doing numbers but you know where we're, 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 we're going to just throw all that outside the box I, 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 we're, we're just going to say another thing if you haven't done it okay you're sitting at home clean up your house do do some spring cleaning you know I noticed for me when this quarantine started to bust out that was the first thing I did I was like I'm about to do some spring cleaning move stuff around you know went looked through some clothes was like okay i don't need this can't fit this no more donated a few items then i turned around sold a few items you know it says it's a give and a take with it you know but I, I went as far as you know wiping down the walls you know just doing everything getting everything right you know and after i did that then i was like okay let me go to my car let me start you know cleaning out both of my cars thoroughly did that you know and i felt accomplished with that so that's another thing just 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 do some cleaning just i would personally feel like if i'm in the space and it's not clean or it's cluttered in some type of way like oh my god that that would drive me just just banana yes i i couldn't do it I, mm -mm. i couldn't do it i would go mad okay so let's say another thing that you guys can do to keep you from going insane learn a new skill that's fundamental i would suggest learning a new skill that you know that can make you money something that's just off the wall from what you normally do you know if you work in the fast food industry and you know during this quarantine or you know, or you just work something in the food industry, but it's not employed right now. Because I know some fast food places, a lot of them in my area are still operating. But you got some restaurants that were closed down. You know, people lost some jobs. So for that, you know, do something else. Like, learn a skill like coding or something. You making code, learn how to code. You know, look at different tutorials on YouTube or something about it and... You know, hey, open up your own restaurant per se, or some type of food industry business that you can run online. You learn how to code, but that whole website, everything up yourself. Boom. But do something. Do something outside the box from what you normally do. You guys get the drill. Okay, do something completely different from your current field. Because after this quarantine, things is going to be different. Things, life is not going to be what we used to know. I even see it just going out getting groceries. People is just weird and different. It's just, it's a new world out here. Just a, how they say, a new world order. So definitely, you know, just clean. Do some spring cleaning. Do some laundry. Do all those cleaning things. And I do have another, another suggestion, I would say. I can take up some time for you guys. I'm going to end this on the last one. I would say do something like learn how to plant or grow your own food. You know, that's, that's fundamental, you know. Try to, like, find out how to grow some tomatoes. Or like spring onions. Spring onions is super easy to grow. Like I'm actually growing some in my window sill right now. And them bad boys is tasting. I'm telling you. But get different plants. Get different things. Learn about things that can, can help you. Or things that you can easily grow. I know you can do spring onions, tomatoes, onions. You can even grow green peppers, potatoes at home. Just if you don't know how to grow no type of vegetable or nothing, guys, 
put that down as a task, a must do. And I'm just throwing it out there. If you want something super easy, because when y'all come back to the next podcast, I want y'all to already been able to test this out and grow something. A safe, fail proof vegetable. It's the spring onion. Go to your local grocery or somewhere where they, you know, selling something. Where I'm at, we got the Rand Dazzles and stuff, you know. Or you can even go to Myers or something. Get some spring onions. It's real cheap, a little bustle over there, you know, in the veggie ses- section. You know, soak them bad boys in some water overnight. Get a little bit of soil, stick them bad boys in there. I tell you, they like grow overnight. It's, it's crazy. Indefinite supply of food, guys. So, definitely want to leave that on that last note for you guys. But I do want to give a shout out to our two other sponsors. We got the SG Dynasty, the clothing brand for the kings and the queens. So if you want to get lit, get that new apparel. Go to sgdynasty.com. And a shout out to our other sponsor, Kids of Fur. For all our fur parents out here. If you got a little fur baby, you want to spoil them, go to kidsoffur.com. If you want to get a custom t-shirt for yourself, fur parents, we got that too at kidsoffur.com. So check them out. And you know, I just want y'all to have a great day, a blessed day. Keep your head up. Stay positive. Definitely apply those things. I'm telling you, it's going to keep you busy for a little bit. So hopefully you won't, you know, go crazy during this quarantine. Do those things. Also, you know, if you want to hit me up, write me up. You can uh, hit me up on my social media forums. You want, If you're more of an Instagram person, we got So God Like Official. You can add me on it there. Hit me up there. Like the pictures. You know, say what's up. I'm going to have some contests going soon. So, those likes and those comments are going to matter. Also, you can go to YouTube. We got the Continental Espionage there. Add us on there. We got a whole lot going on on that channel. You know, to stay in that loop. And if you want to hit me up through email, we got Continental Espionage 1 at gmail.com. Hit me up if you want to talk, say what's up, and I want y'all have a great day. All right now, take care.